So my name is Liz Kramer and I am um, a potter here in Evanston. At the time that I started pottery, again, I was looking for something that just sort of got me out of my work headspace and stress of having two little kids and traveling all the time. And it was just, I had to focus to get anything done. So for that time that I was doing it, I realized I wasn't worried about any of the other things that were going on because I really had to pay attention to what I was doing. I love to make vases. People must drink a lot of coffee because I saw a lot of coffee mugs. It's really fun to see this like lump of clay and then, you know, a couple weeks later it's a coffee pot or a coffee mug or a teapot or whatever. You save your good things for company or, oh, I don't want to use that because it's too nice. Like, what are we waiting for? You know, why are we using the ugly plastic cup instead of the pretty cup we really like? It's nice to have beautiful things that aren't so precious that you can't use them. Yeah. I'm one of the co-directors of Evanston Made, and I do the marketing and social media. I mean, our mission is to present Evanston artists to the public. We, we moved here because we love the location and the, you know, the ambience and the sense of community, but to be within other artists, is, it's even better. There's so many artists in Evanston, and we really wanted to create an organization that, that helped them um, level up their art, give them a community. Roughly, I think there's something about 10,000 artists in Evanston um, out of 70,000 people, so that's a pretty big percentage. And that includes uh, writers, musicians, um, actors, uh, performing arts, uh, visual arts. A lot of people don't even know that their neighbor may be an artist, but they're in their studio doing their thing and um, they don't really have that chance to network and interact. So we provide um, that ability for them to connect and get to know each other and share ideas and support each other, which is awesome. 